What's good? What's up, Messy Mob? It's your girl, Messy Maya, and I am back again with another video, girl. So this video is gonna be a little messy, but it ain't my fault, girl, child. These celebrities be wildin' out, girl. Every single time I turn my head, the girl can't even keep up with it, girl, okay? These celebrities be wildin', but we're gonna get into it all. Sexy red child, girl, I, I, mm. We're gonna get into it, okay? So make sure you like, comment, and subscribe and turn on that post notification bell so you know every single time I post. It's Messy Maya, it's the Messy Mob Girl. We are lit over here, trust and believe that. And yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. So in the nicest way possible, because y'all know I'm a black woman myself, the last thing I wanna do is sit up here and... <laughs> the last thing I wanna do is sit up here and kick a black woman while she down, child. But we all know Sexy Red for being a ratchet hood booger, girl. That is the nicest way that I'm going to put it, girl. That's really what it is. And, and if you disagree with me, I don't know what to tell you, girl. A ratchet hood booger that makes promiscuous records, girl, okay? And that a couple, and got a few viral songs, girl. That's really what it is. So, late last night on her story on Instagram, one of her tapes were released. Girl, and I can't tell you now. That poom poom is indeed not pink, girl. <laughs> let me stop. But no, okay, so it was, it, child, let me stop laughing. So it was leaked on her story, okay? So, and this is my thing. So during the video, the flash is clear in her face. And it's just like, at this point, it's like you, you're not having these men signing NDAs, especially if you're still messing with these, especially if you're still messing with these hood niggas. You know what I'm saying? These clout chasing broke hood n girl. Okay, they they're gonna they're gonna want clout off you, girl. So it's like have them sign an NDA and tell him to get that damn camera out your face. Camera with the flash on, all in the poom poom, girl. All in her face, girl. Oh, girl. And I'm just like, sexy red girl. And I understand, girl, you're not the one who posted it, but baby. It's time to take some responsibility and put them grown woman pants on, girl. Why you had that man in your face with his camera phone in your face, girl? With the flash on, too. It's one thing if, he, if you know what I'm saying, if he hitting it from the back and you really don't know that he's recording. But it's like, girl, he was in your face, flash on, all up in it, girl. I don't understand. So she didn't stay in the dark too long. Not too long after it was posted, she actually got on Twitter, basically not making a statement, but just letting her fans know that she is heartbroken and y'all know that she didn't do it. Her statement or tweet says, I'm so heartbroken. Anybody that know me knows I wouldn't do no goofy like that. Ciao. Okay, so that's what she had to say. Now let's get into what the fans had to say and how they reacted. Okay, so this one says, somebody said, <laughs> somebody says, Sexy Red, you lied to us. Everything is brown, child. So when I came across the video on Twitter, why is this one of the first things that I said, girl? <laughs> All right, so the next one says, poor Sexy Red, please keep grinding my love. Okay, so I feel this way too. I just hope that she doesn't let this, you know, put this hurt in the stump. Girl, keep going. You know what I'm saying? But also take accountability. So the next one says, after seeing that sexy red tape. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, girl. It was not flattering. Okay, so like I said, I feel like this entire situation is a mess. But are we really surprised? That's my thing. I feel like a lot of people are like getting on Twitter, getting online. Like I said, it got the whole social media in a frenzy, okay? The whole social media world in a frenzy. But it's really just like, are y'all surprised? Like this is literally what she puts out there. And I know that some girls do it just as a persona. You know what I'm saying? To get them coins and to get clout or whatever. But it's like when one of the girls that actually talks about being promiscuous and literally doing stuff like that actually you know what i'm saying it's actually proof that she be doing stuff like that y'all y'all are like so surprised what are y'all surprised about but baby like i said girl that that coochie was not pink girl like what happened come on that's the song that made you get cloud girl what happened girl not that i'm mad about it because you know 
it ain't nothing wrong with having a little a little brown coochie, but it's like, girl, you 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 capping in your songs, girl. But on a serious note, okay, so she came out with the little statement tweet or whatever, basically saying how she is heartbroken, girl. And I just, I low key, but high key just don't like how she's turning herself into a victim because it's just like, girl, take responsibility, okay? And it's sad either way because nobody wants to be exposed like that. It's one thing if she was exposed like on someone else's page, but it was put on your page. Like it was put on your page, so who has your phone? And this is my thing too. A couple of days before the um, tape actually got leaked, it was this guy who was recording. Child, you know what I'm saying? Them clout chasing hood niggas, child. You know what I'm saying? They they messing with a girl with some clout, and, and you know what I'm saying? They don't know how to act. So basically. A couple days ago, before the tape actually got leaked, it was a guy she was laying up with. He was on live, and he he turned his camera. <laughs> it's not funny. He turned his camera to basically show that Sexy Red was sleeping in his bed or whatever. So if, if this is if this is the same guy, because it's just crazy how these two timelines are very close. If this is the same guy, girl, you should have cut him off the very first time because that was some goofy stuff that he did. Very much clout chasing. Very much trying to try trying to get a moment so if that was the same guy it's just really just like girl girl but even if it wasn't you would think that you would you would have learned your lesson from two days ago when someone else so-called tried to expose you for being laid up with them trying to get clout off you trying to get clout off your name so it's like girl how these men sign an nda you know what i'm saying he got the flash oh in it girl and i'm just like girl if i girl you should have told him to get that phone out your face. Get the phone out. Get, get the phone out of my face. What are you doing? You got the. He literally had the camera flash all up in it, girl. If you don't tell him to get that camera out of your face, like what did you think was gonna happen? He was just gonna keep it safe, and then if he recorded it off your, cause, cause I know you ain't get that man your password. So it was like, if he recorded it off your phone and then posted it right after or whatever, it's, girl, I feel like either way, she needs to take responsibility. Just be a little bit more careful, girl. It's like, cause, cause you know what I'm saying? And I know it can be heartbreaking. I, I understand, but it's like, it's, it's like, oh no, I'm sorry to my fans who was, who was basically forced to watch that. It's like none of that. It's just, oh, I'm so heartbroken. Y'all know I would never do something like that, but you know, you're the person that stood there and, and had that flash in your face and didn't tell him to turn it off. You're the person who are messing with these men and not having them sign NDAs to protect yourself. I'm just saying, girl, accountability is key. Okay, that's all I'm trying to say, girl. Instead of trying to make yourself the victim, which you are technically because it's, it's, it's just like, girl, why would you why would you even post that in the first place? She's the victim, I understand. But it's like, girl, take a little bit of accountability. We're all adults here, okay? The video was not flattering. That's all, I, that's all I'm going to say. And, and you know what? I literally went on Twitter and that was the first thing I was punched in the face with. And I, I just, ciao. Okay, so that's what I have for you guys today. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And please turn on that post notification bell so you guys know every single time I post. It's Messy Maya. It's the Messy Mob Girl. We are lit over here. Trust and believe that. And yeah, again, it's Messy Maya. Bye.